Hi guys, I'm going to be doing the tag, um, my top five um, favorite brushes. And this was tough because I like love all the brushes that I have. So to pick a top five, I was like, oh my gosh, like what can I not live without? So I narrowed it down and I think I like figured out what my top five brushes are. And today is like a very rainy day. Um, it's like gloomy and stuff. So I have no makeup on, it's just all, just have like moisturizer and stuff on my face. Um, got out of the shower, so this is what my hair looks like. And it's just like a very chill day at home. Just wearing like a nice comfy sweater and just hanging out. And I was like looking through videos and stuff and looking, I was like I want to do like a fun tag, so I thought I'd do this one. So. Let me go ahead and show you guys outside because it's like super. You see the rain? It's like really there. Yeah. Um, it's like raining and stuff. So I hope this doesn't get too dark and you can't see me. <clears throat> so let's hope lighting doesn't like just mess this all up. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start off with my first brush, and I just love this brush. This is the C159 Liner and Chisel Fluff Brush by Coastal Scents, and it is dual-sided or dual-ended. It has a flat, like, shader side to pack on eyeshadow, and it also has a um, angle side to it that I like to use when I'm lining my lower lash line um so i absolutely love this brush because i think like i think i could use it for everything like it has this side so if this was like the only brush i had i could use this for eyeliner I could use this to line my lower lash line i could use this to apply my eyeshadow and to even like blend in or like blend out any eyeshadow and stuff like that so i absolutely love this because i think i could do anything with it or or everything with it the next brush is going to be the e.l.f. powder brush and it just, well, there we go, it's just a flat top brush and I love this brush because again it's something that I can use for many different things. I can use this to buff in foundation which is what I use it for and then I can use this because you know it like it doesn't soak up your foundation so it like stays clean and so you can actually buff in your foundation and then when you want to set it you could use the same brush like you don't have to clean it or anything because it doesn't have like it doesn't keep foundation in it like like residue or anything um so you can see like it looks clean but like I used it yesterday and I haven't washed it so it's just like it doesn't soak up your foundation in the bristles so like I absolutely love this because you can use it to like put your foundation on and then to like set it you can even use it for bronzer and stuff like that so and even your blush too so this is like a multi-purpose brush and then my next favorite brush is like a random brush that doesn't have like a maker or anything to it like it's all beat up you can see at the end it's like scratched off and this is what it looks like and I absolutely love this side this is my favorite side because when I go to like brush my brows, it's not like stiff. Like I have other um, eyelash brushes and no eyebrow brushes and eyelash combs like like this, but the bristles for the eyebrow brush are like stiff and hard. And this one, it just like I just love it. I've had it I think for a while, but I don't remember where I got it from. But I really like it. That's just what that looks like. Um, I don't really use the lash comb end of it because I have another one that I like for that. But this is a favorite right here. And then <clears throat> we have the Coastal Scents. Um, it's just an angled liner brush. Um, I love this to apply my gel liner on my top lash line because I don't know it. Um, and I don't think this is how the brush was meant to be, but it's how mine came. I'll show you. You see how the tip is kind of like 
like going up towards the end you see how it's like now it's facing down um but I just absolutely love that and I think it was the way it was packaged like it was bending it but it actually made like it works the brush like it it makes it so easy for me to apply gel liner so like I said I don't think that's how the brush was intended because it does look like it's bent if you look at it um but I really like it and this is Coastal Scents mmm I got it in the Think Pink brush set I but it's just like a regular synthetic um, bristled liner brush and last but not least is another eyeshadow brush that is my favorite again doesn't have a brand I think I got this one at Target like just a Target brand of brushes and this is what it looks like it's also it's not flat like it is if I compare it to this one you see the difference like like it's not flat it is a fluffy brush but I love this one because I can use it to blend out eyeshadow or I can even use it to pack on so this is like another all of the brushes that I have that are my favorite are because they have several things that I can use them for so like if I'm traveling or you know going away for the weekend or something I can just take like really these four brushes or these four and be like set like I won't need anything else um, but yes, I really like this one because it's fluffy, so it works for blending, but then it does have that like, you know, like a shader type feel to it, so it's also good to pack on eyeshadow, and it like covers your entire lid, so I really like this, and like I said, I think these are both, they are, they're the same type of like maker, but I don't remember where I got them. I mean, I've had these for such a long time, I think like years even, and I don't remember, like, I want to say I got them at Target, because this one I feel like I got at Target, but now that they, they're like the same thing, see, they like look the same and everything, um, so maybe Target, like the Target brand, because I know Target has a brand of brushes or whatever, so that pretty much completes my five favorite brushes brushes um I do have I don't want to say quite a few but I do have like three different stands with all my brushes in them but these I would have to say I absolutely love and if I had to for some strange odd reason if I had to get rid of my brushes and just pick five <laughs> these would be the five so that pretty much completes this little video if you watch this and you want to participate go ahead and do the tag i tag you but that's it thank you for watching bye